Hello, welcome to HMP. Are you having troubles connecting solar panels to your EcoFlow solar generator? Got the solution. You open them right up. A little Velcro. They unfold very nicely with a little with a little kickstand behind them. See? They fold out to give you the right angle from the sun. You just fold them back. And you open up the four solar panels. To give you access to the sun, you can even hang them. See the little hooks? You can hang them from a wall on a tent or wherever you might be. And they fold up very nicely, just like this, and like that. And a nice pouch, which has all your cords and your wires and everything that you need in it. For example, it has the cable. It makes it all possible. The link to which I'll, I'll show you to Amazon down below where you can find this, this cord, this uh, adapter. There's all kinds of other cords in there. It'll help as well. It even has a MPPT controller. It's built in. You can plug your phone into it like I have the cable plugged in right now. Even with only one panel exposed it'll charge my phone. And you see that other cord down there at the bottom that pulls out and plugs in with that adapter. to the solar generator right on this side. This is the Paxis Rockman solar panels. You can see they're foldable. It's one, two, three, four of them. As you'll notice, they fold up, fold into a nice package, nice little suitcase style. You notice right now that they're hooked up to the solar generator. On the back side, they have two little kickstands that come out to hold it up at the right angle to the sun. And they have a pouch in the back that holds all the wiring along with the MPPT for controlling the uh, output of the, of the solar energy. Right now it's cloudy, so it's not putting out a tremendous amount. As the sun comes out, it'll get higher and higher. Right now it's a little bit cool and it's still spring. But it is charging the unit. Earlier you heard me say that I had solved the problem of connecting the solar panels to the solar generator. I did. With this dongle. It has an XT60 connector to plug into the into the River Pro. And it has a female connector to plug the solar panels into. There's the port. Now nowhere on the internet could I find this reference, so we had to put two and two together and figure out what, what would be helpful. And there it is plugged right into the unit. Then you take the plug from the solar panels and just plug it directly in to the adapter like this. And it charges the unit from this from the solar panels. Very quick, very easy, and it's doing it right now. It's uh, not a very much, not a lot, but when the sun comes out, it'll hit close to a hundred watts of power. Here's the panel where you plug in the solar generator uh, to the solar panels. One moment, I'll open it up. Here's the here's the adapter. There's the plug. Let's see how it plugs in. And there you have it, ready to go to charge your to charge, the total solar panels are ready to go to charge your system. I hope this short review has helped you. This short review has been brought to you by the XT60 to female solar generator adapter. I'll leave the information below in the, in the comments so you can see where you get it. Hope it's been helpful. Until next time, this is HMP. See ya.